sometimes you just gotta come outside, listen to the birds, get out in nature, just enjoy the day. Day 13, we're making homemade gnocchi. Gnocchi. I don't know, gnocchi. What do we've got here? We've got potatoes, semolina flour, all-purpose flour, an egg, olive oil. And Josh. What? I need, we need you. For what? To make a good video. I'm gonna take these, peel these right here, and I'm gonna throw them away. What? While the potatoes are boiling, I'm gonna get the flour ready for the dough. Let's do it. My mom sent me this in the mail, and I have no idea what they are. It's like Christmas. Oh yeah, baby. A ravioli stamp set. You can't imagine what Christmas is like in my house. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? I don't even know how to use this. Oh my. This is like one of those things. Oh, square raviolis. My mom loves me. I guess we're gonna have to have some raviolis soon. My mom also sent me is a, a gnocchi board. Are you kidding me? Look at that. I'm literally making gnocchi right now. I had no idea that the Amazon guy was coming right now, but I'm using this, so it's gonna be a good day. All right, potatoes are done. I'm putting them in the food processor here. The potatoes are done in there. And then you're just gonna dump the potatoes into a bowl and then uh, you're gonna let them cool off to about room temp. And then we're gonna add an egg. There's a little left over here. I'm gonna continue to just stir that in there to get it nice and combined. I'm gonna slowly add some of this flour mixture. I'm making gnocchi. Gnocchi. All right, so what I'm gonna do is cut these into like small little bites, like uh -huh. that, and then I'm gonna roll them on this lovely new, Ooh. Wow. Ooh, wow, this new gnocchi roller. Let's give it a try. I don't know why I bent down, can't see me. <laughs> All right, great. Can you see me? Make sure it's on. It is on. <laughs> Get my pan ready for the sauce. We're gonna cook these bad boys up. What we got? We got some pasta, the spinach, the tomatoes, with some garlic, rosemary. We use some wine in this sauce, some pesto. Hey, kiddo. Sharing is caring. Hey. But you share all the time. Wow, thanks. Down here. Let's eat. All right. <laughs> the first bite. Oh, let's here we go. That is a lot of flavor. Pasta is probably the best that I've had yet. Like texture, density. Best yet. Definitely shouldn't burn the oregano next time. It's the only flavor I'm tasting right now. Really? Probably because I'm mad about it, but don't add oregano until after. It's, it's a trap. That is the only flavor I don't like. It's the burnt oregano. Tomatoes add a great, great lightness to the whole dish. Pesto is really good. Honestly, I'm really happy with how this turned out. Look at that, I ate the whole thing. He ate it all. It's all gone. This would go on the menu, for sure. Mmm. Mmm. Honestly, anything with pesto is worth eating. Amen. This is a piece of garlic right here. Should I eat it? You dare me? Wow. 
Wow. That's probably the best thing I've eaten yet. <laughs> Garlic's good for your heart. Thanks, Mom, for the pasta roller. The gnocchi board really made this work out well. This tastes the most like a pasta I would try in my parents' restaurant out of any of the pasta that I've ever had. So, that's good news. Mmm, <laughs> why is garlic so good? Thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying your time here with me. I know I've been so thankful for all the views, all of the people watching, all the nice comments I've gotten from people, and just want to say thanks for being a part of this journey. Today's day 13. There's still a long way to go, so I'd love for you to stick around um, and stay connected. Make sure to like and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications for when our new video, when our, my new videos, I don't know, when the videos come out. And uh, if you didn't like what you saw here today, just double tap that dislike button, get your anger out, and we'll see you back tomorrow. Now I have to go clean the dishes.